Praise the living God. We want to share a prayer with you. If you got any problems, right now lift it up in your heart. There is nothing God cannot do. There is no situation God cannot solve. There is no disease or illness God cannot cure. The Bible said God's hand is not short that he cannot reach us. His ears are not deaf that he cannot hear us. The only demarcation between us and God is sin. So as my sister has spoken to you about sin, we lift all of you up before God. First, I thank God for a beautiful day like this. We worship him, we adore him. We lift his name high because there is none like him. Blessed be his holy name. Our Lord and our God, we bring before thee with our humble supplication to call, co confess our sins. In any way we have sinned against you that will be a hindrance to this prayer. Lord, we ask for forgiveness of sins. We repent of all the sins. We ask for forgiveness. And we receive forgiveness in the name of Jesus Christ. But our Lord, as I lift up every decanton in this arena before you, in this shopping center, Lord, you know all of them. Even before ever they got into their mother's womb, according to the book of Jeremiah chapter 1, says, before ever you got into your mother's womb, I have ordained you. I know about you. And so Lord knows everything regarding you. And because God, God knows everything about you, we lift your problems up before God and we ask God, God, please visit everyone in this arena one by one. And whatever be their problem, solve it. Father, we special request we bring before the, the, drug, the drug addicts. We bring before the, the alcoholic. Everything that has taken control of our life. Lord, we bring them before you because we cannot do much. All we can do is to lift up the problem before you and leave you, God, for you to finish it up because you know how to do it and what to do. You can do what no man can do. And so, Lord, over to you. Take control in the powerful name of Jesus. Amen. Lord, at this time, we will not fail to remember our relations, our friends, our neighbors, all those admitted in the hospital, is it because of COVID and other illnesses? Lord, you send it your word and your word healed them. So, Lord, at this particular time, we send your word because the Bible said in the book of Jeremiah 30, 17, I will heal your wound and restore your health. The Bible said God's word cannot void. He cannot lie. He's not a man that he shall lie. Not in the son of man, well, will he say and he cannot do it? Has he spoken and did he not come to pass? So, we, as we send the word of God to you, we believe it. And as God has said, so shall it come to pass. Receive the healing in the powerful name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for this wonderful time. We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. Blessed be thy holy name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen and amen.